Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to Worship Runner 2. In the last episode, we tried and failed to get our gigantic hull, our gigantic battle carrier hull. Uh, and today, I think what's going to be easiest to do here for this episode is basically just try to get some S ranks that we missed out on otherwise, such as this one. Uh, so we're on EL2, and let's go with the Grey Ghost because it's fast enough to do this. But, um,. I'm starting to realize that a lot of the things we need to get for the completion are very grindy items. So, what I would like to propose is that we are try we try to do a live stream sometime this weekend. This is also because uh, the hours I'm working make it difficult to actually record every night. Because all I want to do is sleep, so I can get enough sleep to work efficiently the next day. So, I propose we plan on doing a live stream sometime this weekend, Friday or Saturday, maybe even Sunday. I'm not sure yet. But um, that way, let's get this, um, that way we can have one session where uh, we aren't necessarily on any kind of time constraint and we can just go nuts and collect all of the things. And it'd be fi fun to do live anyway. So today we're going to just do a couple of relatively menial things and then we will get in there uh, on a live stream sometime this weekend. And yeah. Now, I wish I could give a more specific time or date than that, but Enemy I don't know my schedule for the weekend yet, and it is Wednesday night. I won't know if I'm working Friday until Thursday night, and I won't know if I'm working Saturday until Friday night, because that's the way scheduling works around here, and it's insane, so I apologize for that, but... Alright, let's go ahead and grab the Iowa here. Oh, I gotta get, like, next to them. Stop. There we go. Survive, survive. Yeah, stop talking and start counting. They're gonna die before this works. Come on, two, three, four. Oh, it's gonna be close. It's gonna be close, but I think we got it. Yes, good. Let's get the hell out of here. All right, now we just need to kill everything. Come here, you jerks. Uh, torpedoes. Where's my torpedoes? There we go. God, I have a lot of torpedoes on this thing. Oh yeah. Here we go. Y'all don't stand a chance now. I love using torpedoes. True, there are plenty of other more efficient means of killing things, but torpedoes are still fun. I want to watch the carnage happen here, actually. Hopefully my torpedoes reach them. They're sailing away, so there's a chance that they might not get there before they run out of steam. Chaff, flare, now do we have the championship pennant on here? Uh, it looks like it, yeah. <gasps> yeah, see, a lot of my torpedoes are running out of steam before they get to the enemy ships, which is a problem. Enemy ship sunk. Enemy ship sunk. There we go. Now we're getting the hits we need. We can also do this and let the AGS guns help out. Flare, chaff. That is ammo? No, it's parts. I need that. Let's make your bow jet thruster. Oh, I took it off for the ECCM. I might as well leave it that way, honestly. This ship is like one of the few ships that doesn't need a bow jet thruster. <laughs> Um, and it might need the ECCM to help kill stuff, so, yeah, might as well leave it set up that way, honestly. Uh, chap. Oh boy, a lot of ships in this group here. Apologize for the sniffling. But, you know, that's what happens. It's just the time of year, I guess. Oh boy. Also, hello, Rebel Wind. Let's go ahead and see if we can kill you real quick while we're here. Chef. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can skip all this dialogue now. And there we go. <coughs> Sunk. Let's go back. Um, those guys are kind of dying. Yep. Let's turn around and get that last part straight. While the torpedoes and the AGS guns finish off all these destroyers. Uh-huh. 
Kill that one, maybe. Please, guns. Thank you. That's the other reason I like to fire my guns manually a lot rather than using uh, auto engagement mode, just because sometimes auto engagement mode does not target the things you want it to target, and there's nothing really you can do about that. So, yeah. Hello, everybody. You can sail right into my torpedoes. It's very nice of you. Oh no, then they turned. Dang it. Well, they didn't turn that much. Which means I can still get ahead of them and fire all my torpedoes. Chef. AGS guns for days, obviously, as usual. Very nice. Any more crates out of that mess? Nope. Alright. So we're gonna head over here now. Uh, oh yeah, we're playing on hard difficulty so that we can make sure we actually get any more drops that might happen. Speaking of that, on 140, there are a couple of hard difficulty only drops, but they're things that we already have through regular research anyways. So, they are Aegis System 2, obviously we have better than that. And they are, uh, the other one is uh, Electronic Jamming Device 2, which I'm pretty sure we also already have through uh, research, but... We also haven't got a ton of parts crates this mission, so... You know, I don't think there's much chance of us getting any of that stuff, really. Whether we want it or not. But at least we got the survivors off of the friendly ship, which is the hardest part of getting in this rank on this mission. But, you know, we got it. Ooh, ammo. That'll be for my torpedoes. Once I go back and get the ammo, that is. <sighs> there we go. Got more destroyers down here. And then one lone cargo ship up there. Where are you at, destroyers? There they are. They're heading to my starboard side. So we're gonna get out in front of them a little bit here. Gonna switch to the torpedoes and uh, light them up. Chef. <laughs> I do love these torpedoes. Get over here, get right up next to them so they can't possibly dodge or outrun my torpedoes. Oh, your torpedoes are cute compared to what I'm using. Huh? Flare. Hey, chaff, you should be bigger. More ammo. One more. There we go. Flare. And, um, yeah, there we go. Cool. We could go find the transports and stuff, but they won't be a big enough of the destroyed percentage to matter, so let's just go ahead and back out of here. Yep, there we go. As expected. And that gets us the multi-purpose radar, which is not new. Which is kind of a shame, but... Is there anything else in here that would be new for us? No. Okay, well, that's alright, I guess. Any other missions here? 171, destroy the enemy blockade. This is Werner only. Um... Hmm. <sighs> hmm... taking a look here. There aren't more things we need, but we do need to get an S rank on this mission, so let's try this with the cruiser. Since it's an earlier mission, the cruiser might actually be able to handle this. 171, I'm trying to think. Oh, it's this one. That's right. Alright, well, go nuts. They're AGS guns. We're going to skip dialogue here, obviously, because we've done three playthroughs of this game in this one Let's Play series alone, so don't need that anymore. Um, we do not have torpedoes. Okay. Oh, AGS guns here. And I'm going to have to take manual control for a lot of this, it seems, because it doesn't know what I want them to shoot at. <sighs> but, 
It still works out. Oh, that's parts great. Here, let me launch a helicopter to get that stuff. <clears throat> and we're going to go ahead and kill these guys here quickly. Helicopter should be going back to that one parts crate. This is PT boat. There we go. It was in there somewhere. Just had to find and kill it. Now, of course, there are more airfields here that we're going to have to try and deal with. Uh, I think I know where they are. Helicopter, did you get that parts crate yet? It looks like it's just sitting there. There we go. Alright. Now come back. Now we're going to go down here. Uh, we're going to get our AGS guns ready and start killing this group of ships. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Uh, chaff. There we go. UD, we got another parts crate. I don't think we need any of these regular parts here, but we'll grab them just because they're here. Keeping the helicopter back here with me so it stays safe. I'm gonna let my high angles and AGS guns go nuts through the island. I'm pretty sure there's an airfield on the opposite side of the island here. <clears throat> and I, of course, would like that to be dealt with, if possible. <laughs> Which the high angles appear to be doing, at least to some extent. Because remember, the high angles can clip through the terrain. I don't know why they can, but they can. So, I'm going to use that to our advantage here a little bit. How's the rams doing? Oh, we got lots of rams. Plenty of rams, even. Funds crate here from one of these dead planes, which is very nice. Another one right there, cool. Ah, there's a carrier in this group. I see. Jeff. Ow. Alright, well, that's uncalled for. Battleship, which survived. Ow, I just put out a fire. Put that one out for me, please, guys. Come on. Come on. Well, I got another repair kit, so I guess we'll just use that. There. God, what are... Are they using, like, napalm missiles or something? Because that, that is a thing in this game. I just don't know if the enemies use it, but it sure feels like they do. This is crazy. Ah, uh, how much longer do I let this go without... All right, fine, fine. Beginning Full repair, jeez. Didn't want the ammo depot to blow up and take up most of our health, so fine. You win this round, aircraft carriers. We're gonna go back for the. We're gonna pick up some ammo for the Rams here. Yep, and funds. No, go back for the funds. <laughs> I think all the buildings on this island are dead now, I think. But uh, we'll head <clears throat> just a little bit further east just to confirm that. Yeah, yep, all gone. Nice. Back around. For being a twin hulled ship, this is quite maneuverable. But it's also a fairly light twin hulled ship. But you know. Funds great, give me that. Not that we need funds for much else at this point in the game, but still, you know, it's the principle that matters. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Now that airfield over there, did we get that? Oh, it looks like we probably got everything over there. Let's take that chaff. Here's a carrier. I'll make sure I kill it first, since it has the damn rockets. Hup. Dodge out of the way real quick here. Yeah. Yes, there we go. The I got hit by one rocket and it set me on fire. Thank you. At least they put it out that time. <clears throat> Take these parts and stuff. Uh, destroy the enemy fleet immediately. Oh, that's why we didn't get an S rank. Well, how quickly is immediately? Like, what, what, what does that mean? Huh. Interesting. I forgot that that was the other objective. 
Okay then, well... Huh. What's left? Oh, there's a carrier over there. Interesting. Very interesting. Yeah. Hit that, sucker. Uh oh. I got off target somehow. There we go. I can't do it. Yeah, nice. More rockets for you. Imbecile. Blah, 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 blah. Funds, hooray. Um, but I'm not going to bother going back for them because we're done with that since we didn't get our secondary objective anyways. But, oh well. We'll have to try it again, I guess. Now, when it says immediately, I wonder how quickly it means immediately. Because that could mean that could mean five minutes, that could mean three minutes, I don't know. But if there's anything that's good at killing stuff immediately, it's the Twin Hole Battleship with that big ass Sepia Pulse Cannon on the front, which can kill pretty much everything from pretty much any range, which is awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, do you, uh, okay, five minutes. Oh, yeah. Alright, so if we just move quickly here, then we got this. Pew! Oh, yeah. And we're gonna do it again. Pew! Um... I do not have chaff on here, so I will be launching my aircraft. Now, oh boy. Oh, I do have the bow jet thruster. That's right, I put it back on. Nice. Um, let's see here. Sepi pulls cannon on that ship right there. I should deal with most of those enemy ships in that group. Yeah, actually, I think we got every ship in that group. Awesome. Okay. Let the high angles deal with some of the buildings here as well. Need to go kill the enemy carriers immediately. Yeah, we definitely got every ship in that group uh, immediately, which is awesome. Uh, stop spawning more reinforcements. Chaff. Gun. Come on, cannons. Work your magic. Oh my god, I love these cannons. Look at this. This is just a thing of beauty is what this is. I love these cannons. They're so good. People keep asking me why I use cannons uh, instead of like AGS exclusively or anything. This is why. This is why. Flare. Uh, we're going to let that stuff go crazy now. Oh yeah, we were playing hard so I can't do that to cheat. <laughs> What is it? Uh, destroy the enemy fleet immediately. Okay, there are uh, two more carriers that I know of, I believe. Um, yeah, let's turn all the way back around here. Full speed ahead. Need to go and find... Where are the other... There we go. There's the carrier. Oh, and then we got the other ones right next to us. Perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not worried about the fire right now. Battleships, battleships. There. I've sunk everything. Ah, apparently not. What's left? What's left? There's nothing on my radar. Uh, oh. There's a battleship over there. Oh, because we only hit the carrier somehow and not the battleship sitting right next to it. Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. Yeah? Yeah? Yes. Done? Are we done? Yeah, nice. See, and that is the power of the Kuli Yaku. Uh, we're okay, we did it. And... Huzzah! S rank. Not that it's anything amazing, but still, we got it. Auto reload system gamma. That's uh, old news for us now. It is amazing. 
but it's old news. It's also EL2, which means that if you're looking for that on EL1, that's not going to help you. But, yeah. Alright. Well, hey, we got a whole episode worth of time anyways, which I wasn't expecting to do. So, like I said, sometime this weekend I will try to do a live stream as soon as I know my schedule, which is, frankly, not very soon at all. Um, but as soon as I know, I will let you guys know, even if it is just in the, short, the form of a short announcement video for a stream. But, yeah, we will try to do some streaming this weekend and uh, do some of the grindier stuff live. So, that'll do it for this episode of Warship Gunner 2. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed, and as always, I hope to see you all in the next one.